Hey friends, so I am super excited for our party tomorrow night, but since I am pre-recording it and getting everything condensed so you guys don't have this massive one hour video demo that I usually do, I'm gonna share a couple of my favorite essentials with you beforehand. So right now we're gonna talk about our toy care essentials. So the first one is our cleansing mist. And a lot of people may think at first, you know, um, cause I get told this all the time, that's why I know this. You're like, oh, I don't need a toy cleaner. I use my antibacterial soap, um, just run some water over it, I'm good. Well, what that's actually gonna do is because there's alcohol in your soap, it's drying up the pores of the toy and actually making these crevices where the bacteria can then live. And then you're inserting that in yourself and that's when you get yeast infections, bacterial infections, all the fun things that come with it. So instead, um, just go ahead and just spray it down with the toy cleaner, rinse it with water, you're good to go. Then the next step is you're gonna want to put it in a toy tote, okay? I know a lot of you guys also, you don't have to tell me because I know this is a thing. I know you might put it in a shoe box, put it in your bedside table, shove it under your you know, clothes in your closet, whatever you wanna do. But what it's doing there is it's usually, say in your um, shoe box or whatever, you've got lint and dust and all the fun things in there. You're putting your toy on top of that. So even if you use the cleansing mist, right? You're putting your toy in this lovely shoe box with some lint and dust. And then before you use it the next time, I guarantee you that you're not gonna get your cleansing mist, clean it again, and then put it inside of you. So instead you're gonna put that lint and dust and all the fun things inside your vagina. So my opinions, and you can totally lie to me when I ask you if you wanna add these on, and you can say, no, I'm good. But my opinion is this $18 bottle of cleansing mist, it's gonna last you forever, is worth every penny. You can also clean your makeup brushes with this too if you just need another purpose to have it but otherwise with the tote um, you want one per toy what silicone does is when you if you if you put like two silicone toys in here sitting side by side they're gonna morph and do this really cool science experiment that you're gonna be really mad about your investment so instead of them morphing together just get one tote per toy keep them separate um, they do come in silver or or, no, actually now they're light pink and navy blue. They change every now and then so you can kind of have a good collection. So um, I really recommend one per toy, one per year. Like you're good to go. So um, these are the essentials and it's on you guys if you want to lie to me. Keep doing what you're doing. But I just want to keep you safe and your vagina safe. So stay tuned for more tomorrow. The full demo will stop or be dropped at 8 o'clock on Thursday. Otherwise, I'll just kind of post some little nuggets of information every now and then. But can't wait to party.